Harry Jones. It's all just working out this year. Seven straight race wins in 2024. Harry Jones, we're into the business end of the season. You're leading the championship. It's been an unbelievable season. Just reflect on the journey to this point of 2024. Yeah, it's been a hell of a journey so far in my motorsport career. One that started, I guess, a little bit later than most. I started, uh, skipped the go-karting phase, started in Formula Ford back in 2016. And yeah, my love for the sport instantly was just through the roof. So I've had a, an awesome time in cup cars. Um, got to travel the world, racing Porsche Super Cup, Pro Cup Germany last year. And, and now to come back to Australia with all of this experience under my belt, when you're racing on tracks that you dream of racing your whole life, it's just, uh, yeah, I'm always driving with a, with a big grin on my face. And the first discussions with Porsche Centre Melbourne Motorsport was, we were all very aligned in what we wanted. So the whole approach this year was to go out there and win as many races as possible and hopefully claim a championship. And I guess everyone's put in the exact same effort. If it's myself or it's the mechanic or, you know, team managers, everyone's sort of working towards the same goal. You went to Europe. Uh, you were very competitive in Mobile One Super Cup, which is the most competitive one make field in the world. Uh, you battled for the Rookie Championship, unbelievable season. Watch come back. I guess I loved my time in Europe. I learned from some of the best in the sport, racing for BWT Lechner Racing and Shearer Sport PHX. I did, I think, 20 race weekends last year, which not many people can say in motorsport. And, you know, to learn from teammates like Harry King and Bastion Boost, there was so many so many things that they look at in their drive and that they analyse that I never would have thought of. Part of the drive to come home was, was I wanted to set up a career here in Australia. I love my home country of Australia, make a full-time career driving, but then also start a race team that, you know, that these things that I learnt in Europe, I want to then help the next drop of drivers, you know, pick that up from the first time they hop in a cup car or a race car for that matter. So, yeah, ultimately I love, I love my home country and, and I want to spend my whole life here. So the Porsche Pyramid goes two ways. So it goes to Europe, the Matt Campbell, Jackson Evans pathway that we've seen, but it also leads to supercars. Do you feel like it's a viable pathway for you and that that, that is what your target is for next year? Porsche have such a great platform for drivers, pro and pro-am to develop their skills. We've got cars that are just as fast as a supercar and we've got a field that's almost as competitive. If the only thing you need to change in your driving is, is snatching on a, on, a, on a gear stick, then I think uh, all of us drivers will let up pretty quickly. So cast your mind forward 12 months, where in the lead up to Bathurst next year, where do you hope to be in your career and where do you hope to be driving and where do you hope to be at in general? Yeah, I hope to be on that Bathurst 1000 grid next year. That's a, a lifelong goal of mine from the day I stepped in a race car and uh, to be on that grid rubbing shoulders and banging doors with you know some of the heavy hitters in Australia, that's, uh, that's gonna be incredible. Bathurst, Gold Coast, Adelaide, three amazing circuits, amazing events, uh, and a championship to win. How's your approach and how do you go into those final three rounds this year? Yeah, honestly, crazy, I can't wait. They're the, the three tracks in Australia, the three events I look forward to most. Uh, and I think these last three rounds suit the cup cars really well. Hopefully close out a good season. And finally, very few drivers have won two Carrera Cup Australia titles. What would that mean to you? There's been times in, in, I think, any driver or any athlete's career where you second guess yourself, you, you don't know what's around the corner. And, and there's definitely been a few times recently like that for me. And to come back home and have such an awesome year this year, if we can finish with another title under our belt, it's gonna yeah, mean, mean a lot more than I think I can put words to. Good luck, go well. Awesome, thank you.